LSU. They uh, hosted many Board of Trustees meetings that we attended and opposed their decision making at every point. They then tried to vilify the homeless population. They, they said that we need campus police because homeless people are terrorizing students in the streets as if having police would help this situation. We all know that the cause of homelessness is poverty. We need to reform our police in this city and we need to lead by example on this campus. I appreciate you being out here. I'm a PSU student. I am also PSU staff. I support your movement. I hope you'll supporting me and encouraging whoever ends up as our next mayor to actively, actively work for police reform in our city. We need to demilitarize the police. they're not advocated for. Um, me and a lot of students of color have been trying to advocate for ourselves and it's a pity that we have to do so. We have a lot of inequitable stuff going on at this campus, yet this administration is not doing anything to stop it. Nothing. three years now, or almost three years now, the student union has been fighting against the decision to arm campus security before the armament and after the armament, so this is kind of like, has been our next escalation in fighting against the armament of campus security. When we are talking about this RPSU, the people we are talking to is the Board of Trustees for making this decision, despite pushback from students and faculty. So we want to do away with the board, and we want our decisions to be made by our students and made by our faculty, and with the Board of Trustees model, that is not going to happen. So we all need to say goodbye to the board. between the armament of campus security, which as we just explained today is really only going to lead to us being harmed, it's also our livelihoods that are affected by the tuition increases. Really it poses a disproportionate threat to the students of color, um, people who are houseless, people who suffer from mental illness because they've been criminalized and talked about as people who, need to, who we need to be protected against when in fact they're a part of our campus community. So really it poses a threat of violence and fear towards those types of students.